guys, welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to my EQ2 vlog. My name is D, and you're watching DQ2. So we're just going to get right back into it with Aaron Cleland. If that's how you pronounce his name, might as well be. That's how I pronounce it anyway. Hail. Let's see. He says, say, I could use your help with replenishing those barrels now that you've re removed the lichen creatures. What can I do for you? There are some scraggly looking shrubs that grow on the windy cliffs overlooking the sea, northwest of here, or excuse me, northeast of here. Take the path behind me, and you can't miss them. Their tubers aren't very appealing, but they're rich in nutrients. And I'll say I'll gather them for you. Accept quest. Uh, we need to gather three tubers from the scraggly shrubs. So, the path behind him is right here. So, let's look for shrubs. Yep, I see three, I see two shrubs, I see three shrubs. I see all kind of shrubs. So, we're going to do this one first, and all you do is just click them. And you just get one per, there's two sitting right here, so I get two. Oh, wait, no, that's a wind-blown. That's different, I think. I need a scraggly shrub. That was wind blown. The wind blown one was uh, like uh, for foraging. And you know, uh, there's another quest giver up here that had the foraging ones. So we are already done with that quest. Let's take it back and talk to Aaron. Hey, Aaron. Not much wants to grow in such an unforgiving environment, but I hope that you were able to find us an, a few edible items to add to our store, Stroker. I was. We're going to accept quest. Now we're going to say, you're welcome. He says, oh, that's better than I would have hoped for. Thank you. And I said, you're welcome. May I ask another favor of you? I was hoping you might have been, might be keen on getting us some fresh fish, too. And we're only two minutes into this video, so I'm going to say, yeah, I can do that. That's no problem. Ooh, we're going to get some boots that have lower mitigation, but uh, some attributes. And... Hunt ice clad cod. Let's see on our map here. Oh, it looks like looks like we have dots to tell us right where to go get the cod. So we're gonna head over to those dots and do some jumping on the way, floating, <laughs> just because we can. Excuse me, that was not good. All right, here's ice clay cod. So when you're swimming, if you go below the water, uh, you start losing breath and you can drown. So you gotta stay up at the top of the water and Interestingly, you can fight <laughs> while swimming, which is uh, convenient, I guess. I need five of these suckers. Get close enough. I like that one. So if they're behind, if they're facing the other direction, you can cast those as first spells, assuming that they're all right. 
to let's go for this guy here whoops Uh, I didn't mean to go down below the water. So anyway, we'll attack this guy. One button, two and three. We did. It. You know what was this one? Oh, heroic. That's right. One, two button. He's almost dead. And that makes three out of five. We only need two more of these guys. Let's try this fight. And one more. What was that? Sloppy cod cuts. Not sure what those were, but we'll figure that out later. All right, so we only need one more. Let's do this one here. Because he's close to the shore. Actually, you know what? I think I'm going to go for this this one over here. I can't wait to get more damage spells. All right, we're almost done with this one. Hit him one more time and there it goes. All right, now we can go back. I think probably right. Return. Turn the ice clad. All right. So all we have to do is run up over here, turn this one in, and that'll be it for this video, guys. <clears throat> see what this guy has to, I think we get something let's see he returned and with an armful of fresh fish for us Joker that's wonderful I'm not cleaning them though <laughs> all right Pathfinder boots you're welcome and that looks like the final quest for this guy all right so you know, let's open our bag and let's put on these boots. And let's put on these gloves. I think that's uh, everything. Pocket of... This bucket has only been used to hold sloppy fish guts, and it reeks to prove it. No trade, no value. You know what? I don't think I need that. I'm just going to destroy that. And, you know, this is our old clothing. I'm gonna, for right now, I'm going to put it here. Put that here. Our old weapon. Put that there. Sloppy fish guts. Uh, I'm just going to destroy those two because they're no trade, no value. So, speaking of that, you know, I'm going to spend a couple more minutes here in this video. Uh, where This is the general goods lady. You can buy food if you need food from her. 
usually food and water. Here's some food, uh, some bread. There's other things that they sell, like, uh, I don't know, random stuff, potions, vials, uh, water. So, but we, we should still have water open our sea window. We still have 15 pieces of bread, 15 waters. They last 30 minutes each. So we still have plenty for now. So we don't need to buy, but we can sell. We have some pungent spores, three of those. We'll sell those. And mm, I don't want to sell that. That's our, our uh, house item. So we're going to keep that. And that's going to be it for the channel, guys. So thank you for watching. I hope you guys liked it. If you did, click the like button. Click the subscribe. Turn on the notification bell. And we will see you on the next one. Thanks for tuning in, guys. Talk to you later.